Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be looking at a Flintstone set, the, late, the latest Lego idea set. You like the Flintstones, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> Let's have a little look into it, shall we? <laughs> Okay, so this is the latest Lego Ideas set that they've come up with. Um, yeah, it's, 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 it's a bit smaller than what I thought it would be, but it's, you know, it is nice. You like it? No, we're busy playing with something else. A um, few little problems with it. I mean, some of the eyes look a bit weird, but we, we like to stick on the positive side here. We like to stick on the positive side. Um, and I do have one little gripe with it. Where's Dino? Yeah, see, she's angry about it as well. No, Dino! Yeah. No. But they have le left a little Easter egg in there to explain why he's not in the set. We'll look at these little three or four little figures in a minute. But first things first, you get your uh, one of the last little bills that you get on here. Um, nice little printed Flintstones mailbox. Um, no stickers at all in these sets, like the last couple of idea sets that have come out. No, uh, no stickers. You get a little uh, little letter. So you're getting that. That's, it's a fun little build. Simple, simple little build. Um, it's quite an easy little build to be honest. Yeah, it's uh, a few little, few little niggly little bits on it. Like these, these little bits down there, a little bit niggly. But yeah, but other than that, no, it's uh, it's it's a it's a nice little set. It's nice. Um, <laughs> um, but yeah, so so you're all brick built all the way out to the top. Um, all the way around, uh, you know, it's, it's not nicely finished off, nice and smooth all the way around. And you come around the back, I've just knocked the lamp off. Um, ugh, get the lamp. Glue you, stick you back on there. There we go. So yeah, as uh, Prima Jordi came around, so you come around and it all opens up at the back here, and then then again it opens up again to reveal a slightly bigger open bit, and the roof comes off, nice and easy. That just it just just sits on there. That's all it does. It's not held in by anything else. It just sits cleanly on top there. So that's all that sits on there. Nice nice uh, slope bits going on here. Um, again, it's quite smooth. You're giving the the indication of a little bit of rock built. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, so on the inside. Uh, so you've got a nice little. Nice little uh, build up for the telephone here, uh, using a pot Um And then down here, obviously, you've got the bowling pins. They only give you three pins in it and a little bowling ball. Um, so you get in that. Um, nice little built up lamp, um, which I've worked out why that keeps coming off because I pushed that pin through too much. So, so there we go. Yeah, so again, it's got, it's got a nice little built up lamp. Nice little built up table with some little fruit, fruit in there. Um, and uh, yeah, so you get the little curtains on the front there, little um, zebra, not zebra, a lion, a lion, we've got tiger print kind of thing. Again, printed pieces and the door as well, nicely coloured door. That is just held on by one little, little clip pin down there. It's just held on by one, but it's on there secure enough. It's not going to come off. Yeah, it's quite easy on there. And here is the little TV explaining why we don't have him in here. Because apparently he's missing. I, me personally, I would prefer him in it. Me personally. But, you know. Again, the TV's nicely built up. It's a nice little built up TV. Um, yeah, this, I think it's a bit of a shame. I think it's a bit of a missed opportunity that you know, I've been knowing it. But, anyway, I could waffle on about a while, uh, for a while. Uh, yeah, so you get, the, you get a nice little built up tree on the side here. So you can have that straight. Or you can have it bent down the side here. Um, and you get a nice bit of foliage all the way right around it. And I've knocked some of the foliage off. Oh, I'm not doing that well today, am I? You get foliage all the way around it. You get little, um, what's that? We'll go for today, milk bottles. <laughs> uh, for this for this example. But um, yeah, so it's, it's, it's nice. You know, it looks like the Flintstones house. It, it look, looks great, I think. Me personally, I think it looks all right. Uh, on to the next bit. Get the little car with, um, oh, what's it called? Uh, well, we go with Dino Dino rack of ribs. We we'll go with that, <laughs> and obviously it's supposed to fall over when he holds it on there. But uh, I mean, I feel like, I mean, really think it was supposed to be bigger than that. I haven't seen the Flintstones in a long time, but on smooth surfaces, it moves along quite well. It's just just held in there. Um, it's a bit of a shame that they're filled in the floor though, because obviously he's supposed to run with his feet. Nice little fabric bit here, you know. It's, um, goes, um, yeah, it's just fabric. It's, it's not plastic or anything else like that. It's just fabric. Um, 
and it's quite easy to get the figures in and out of it because as I've just shown you there, you just click that back. Let's get out of him here. And just click him. Oh, down my word, I am not doing that well today. I am really, really sorry. But not much editing. There you go, and you just click them on in there. Enough seats there, enough room there for four people. Yeah, and you just click that back over, and voila, there you go. And it goes in quite easy. And obviously getting them out is even is just the same. You just pull that back, boom, out it comes. This here is just uh, is we go with rack of ribs. It's just held on with, um, uh, with, with just a just held some of the studs there. So you could put it either side, you know, you could put it that side or that side, but it's got plenty of stuff down the side for that. Nice little build up again. You know, the, the little wooden wheels down here. Again, stickers. Yeah, and it uh, goes pretty well. <laughs> it goes pretty well. Oh, no, let's go get it. Right. Okay. Okay. Look at Fred Flintstone. Yabba dabba doo. I'm, I'm really sorry. Um, uh, nice, nice prints all the way right around. Nice dual moulding. Uh, no secondary face. Um, it does look a bit, a little bit weird how they've tried giving them a nose. I think it's a bit of a shame that they didn't give uh, Barney and Fred the nose. Yeah, I know. Because yeah, they've done it with the Flintstone. Uh, the Flintstones. They've done it with the Simpsons sets. So I don't know why they didn't do it with him. You know, give them a, give them a little nose. Give them little noses. Um, but yeah, you know, nice body print. Nice back print. Yeah, nice little Fred. And then we get a Wilma, Wilma. Nice little body print, uh, nice body print uh, as as normal, as per normal. Nice back print as well, all the way right around. And she does get a secondary face, which is which is quite nice. We we'll just spin the hair around, and voila, there we go. Yeah, I, I don't, these two prints, very good prints. I like this one here better though. I do like that one. That's a nice little print. Um, yeah, and they've given the the inspiration of her necklace. Um, that's it's nice, it's nice. Um, that's a nice little uh, especially all of these things, it's pretty good. Um, uh oh, what? you're right. <laughs> <laughs> then we get the Barney, Barney's next one again. He's got that weird kind of like you know, they've kind of made out he's got a nose, but he hasn't got a nose. Um, but again, obviously, it's a little bit plain. His one is because he is just brown in that one. I think that's Emmett's hair, isn't it? It's just orange, isn't it? Uh, yellow, sorry, it's just that, isn't it? Um, no secondary face for him, just the same face, uh, just the one face. Um, again, nice jaw molded, molded legs. Yes, it's very, very nice little figure. And then we get to Betty, So I do recognise this hairstyle from. I think this hairstyle's from Black Widow. Uh, but it works very well with this one, it works very well. Um, yeah, and she does get a secondary face. Ha ha! Yeah, she is. Yeah, we've got good facial prints, but this one's the better one. Nice facial prints again, nice jaw molded legs. Um, a little bit plain on the old back there. Um, again, the colour print, you know, the skin opaque on the on the old chest there is not very good. Yes! It's not very good, you know, because obviously this doesn't match the skin tone, you know. But, um, you know, they, they seem to got it all right with, with uh, you know, they got the skin tone all right there. But then when they get to, those, you, know, you can see the difference in the colour, can't you? But anyway, you know that's that's neither here nor there. You know they, they they seem to be having an issue lately on getting the skin skin tone right on on that one. We just have a quick butchers at the the old uh, the old instruction manual. Like all idea set, they give you a little uh, rundown on the fan designer and also the Lego designer. So you get to um, see it's um, yeah, they give you a little bit of um, information about. Uh, both of them and also on the next page you also get a little bit on the Flintstone see a little bio facts and all that kind of stuff and did you know and about the Flintstones oh yeah that's what I was gonna mention you can obviously obviously Fred's got eyes and Betty's got eyes but you notice that they, they don't but then you look at the figures here they've given them all pupils which I think is a bit weird me personally they've given them all pupils when in in hindsight, they really don't have pupils. They you know they're just um, you know they don't need it. So I don't know why they've done that, but I suppose it's their kind of thing of um, 
making it. <coughs> yeah, you know, one face fits all, isn't it? But that's the way Lego's been doing things lately. But never mind, never mind. Well, anyway, that's my opinion on the set. Anyway, that's my review. Go on, wait. She likes the Flintstones. You like the Flintstones, don't you? Yeah, she likes the Flintstones. She likes. Work. She's starting to watch it now. Um, but anyway, yes, that's my opinion. Uh, for fifty four ninety nine, is it worth the money? Yeah, if you're a fan of Leg, uh, if you're a fan of the Flintstones, definitely. It's a nice little, uh, nice little piece on the shelf. Definitely, 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 definitely. Um, if you're not, yeah, uh, but you are a massive fan of Lego, maybe wait for it if you can catch it on a sale, maybe on Amazon or something like that. Um, but you, uh, regards to the faces on there, yeah, you can get around it. You know, from a distance, they look okay. They look okay. Yeah. <laughs> But anyway, that, that's my opinion anyway. Um, someone's very excitable today. But anyway, please like, share and subscribe to this video. And if you like this, um, and if, whatever set you want to see next, leave in the comments below. You alright? Yeah, leave in the comments down below if you want to set whatever idea you got for the next set you want me to have a look at. Um, and I will see you later. You can say bye. She said bye. Bye.